Hello and welcome to Ramble 2. Uh, this is Ramble for the month of February. Uh, I've been grinding. Uh, I've been doing my thing. I now I've recorded this. I recorded it once. No audio. Recorded it twice. I must have double clicked the start and stop recording. I looked over and I was like, wow, well, again? So now we're here. This is the official Ramble 2, the unlucky Iron Man super late game. I don't know what to call it. Super late game Iron Man progress. I guess I'm not super late game. I'm 570 collection logs. Some people say I'm a noob and I don't have what, you know, I don't have much, we'll say, but that'll come later. I'll work on that stuff later. But anyways, so Ramble 2, we'll go back over what I said Ramble 1. I said I wanted to do, uh, get to 3K uh, Fosanis and I wanted to get to 500 Corp. Uh, so we'll see what kill counts are at. It is 3,112 for Fosanis and... Corp is 420. So we ended up doing, we were doing 15 and 15 a day, something like that. So I was doing 15 Fosanis and 15 Corp piece every day. Um, and then stuff started happening. So let's scroll down fast so we don't spoil it. So we got a spectral on KC418 on the 12th of February. And my goal at uh, Corp was, I want just one sigil first. Let's just get a sigil. Let's put it on a blessed spirit shield. Let's say we have a sigil, right? So that's a grind that for me could be, it could, it could take, I know people that have green logged a thousand and obviously people have gone 10,000 kills, right? So it's something that's very, very lottery, you know, RNG, let's go roll the dice table. So I wanted to keep it slow. Um, and I really enjoy the content. You just poke a chicken, you just boop, boop, you just poke them. So that was nice that I got that out of the way. It's best in slot shield, I think. I don't know if it's Ellie or Spectral's best in slot if you're using ACB or the horn at next, but it's really good um, for prayer drain and for defense in general. So really nice. Then a couple days later, I decided, you know what? I want to be using my harm staff at, at um, Fosani. So I went and I started to learn some, not learn, it doesn't take long to learn, but I started to try to perfect the solo winter Todd method. And in six kills, I got it at, what was it? 14, 14.5 14 mil XP. So it's funny because I got it. I, I got the chest. I went to sleep. I just kept it in my bank. I was like, I'll open it when I have a couple. I woke up the next day. I was like, you know what? Let's just open and see what happens. Boom. Toma fire. I was like, oh, well, that grind's done for the day. Don't have to worry about that one. So that was nice. And then the most amazing thing that happened this month, well, two things, I guess. So I finished full in quiz. <clears throat> it was the weirdest month at Fosani's I've ever had. I did 512 kills. I got six total drops on the Inquisitor table, which is unheard of. I've gone 694 kills, drive nothing. Like I got nothing in 694. So getting that many drops was weird because it's like when you're getting, let's say you just keep getting the same drop over and over again. So you just, I got four staffs, right? Four extra staffs that I, I don't need, obviously, because I have the staff set. I just keep getting staffs over and over again. I was like, wow, is it ever going to end? So 3K I posted, I'll, I'll put the link in the description for Reddit if you want to check it out. Um the loot and stuff that the total loot that I've gotten from the kills. But I basically at three K was like, okay, I can only do like 15 a day total. And it was just not burning me out, but it was just something I wanted to go do other content. I'm ready to go move into other content. The mace is something that is best in slot, but with Scythe on crush, if I have blood runes, it suffices as long as you have full inquisitor. So the inquisitor bottoms were, on my list, probably the most important item that I wanted because I wanted to finish the set. Because the finishing the set means the kills go faster if Osani's, which means I can use it at CMs, which means I can use it, I, I can use it top and bottom at Cal Queen on task. Like there's there's uses and places that you can use the Inquisitor for, and I was really happy to get it. So that was nice, and I finished. I got that on Saturday the twenty sixth. I was like, you know what? I got my full inquest. Let's go send some CM solos. I'm, you know what? I'm feeling it. I just want to do, I think CMs are my favorite content in the game. Um, here, we'll show quick the log. Did I show it? No, I didn't show it. Oh, here it is. So yeah, just Mace missing. Um, but yeah. Uh, then something just insane. I t 
green log, not green log, because it's not really green log, but I had 12 out of 12 uh, raids as well. Um, I'll show the, in, but I needed a hat. I was just doing a raid, chilling, just doing my raids, just doing my time, shooting the home. I look over, I'm like, oh, no way, I just got it, such a hat. That was yesterday on the 28th of February. So it was just like, what? This is perfect. I literally have full ancestral and full inquisitor, and I spent, I don't know how many hours trying to go for these two things. I've done a thousand regular raids, three hundred thirteen cm or three hundred fourteen now cms. Uh, we'll show the log, and I've done. Uh, it's just so relieving, like just just knowing that I don't need purples and all it's based on for cms is time, is just for me fantastic. I. I am happy that now all I need is dust and all I need is two kits. So that's all I need to finish. And I'm super dry in the kits. Like I have one in 314 and I got my first one at 18. So in four more kills, I'm 300 dry of a one in 75 item. Of something that takes 45 minutes ish. You know, when I'm not sweating it out, usually about 45, 40 to 45 minutes per CM. Right. Um, so it's just, oh man, just going for that. But, for me, I'm, I don't know if it's because I'm dry most of the time at places, but I'm super excited that I finished Ancestral and Inquisitor. Like, it's so relieving to know that these items are done. I got a full Spirit Shield. I got my Tome. So if I want to use my Harm, I can. Um, overall, it's just been a really good month. Um, it knocked off three items from my S tier for my items. Here, we'll just pop it over real quick. So that is where it is. If you look, uh, this is from last year. This is crazy. I still have this stuff to do. Um, but yeah, so basically Mace is the only one on the S tier left. I have imbued heart, tore of a top and bottom on the A tier. And then now I added Arcane Sigil. After seeing what it's going to do at Rage 3, I think it's going to be essential for magic in the future of the game. So it's something I really want to do and get. So um, I'm going to have to figure out how I'm going to grind and what I'm going to do this month. But that's... It's just, ah, oh, it's just, I'm so relieved that I have the full Ancestral and full Inquisitor. I really, really want full Twisted Ancestral. It's something, it's kind of like Inquisitor. The kits do nothing for the thing except make it look better, I guess, um, and different, which is awesome. Um, and I really want the dust, right? So I have the, I have Omelette, so I really want dust. Um, and it's just, it would be super nice. It would be super nice to have next pet. Fosani Transmog, Ohm with Transmog, and Zik with Transmog. I, that's the goal here soon, along with getting Blood Scythe. I want Blood Scythe. I want, it's just cosmetics at this point um, for stuff I really want. Torva is a huge, it's, a, it's an upgrade, full upgrade on here um, over Bandos now. So that's something I need to go look into. We'll look at these real quick. The, the, the stack of clues that I've been holding out on. Um, I might continue to hold out on them. I have a little itch to open them sometimes when I'm not getting stuff, but I just, I just put them in here. Eventually one day I'll just run through them. I'll do a little, maybe a stream on Twitch or I'll do a YouTube highlight montage of the, the stuff. But this is the, this is the stuff I'm holding right now. So that's good. Um, and now I've been saying, oh, quickly. Let me turn this on real quick. Item identification so it's easier to see. So I've been saying I really wanted to finish all my herbs by Irits, and I finally accomplished it. So I have, it's just so much um, banked herbs right now. Like if I scroll over, it's 22.5 mil banked herb XP. Obviously not all the secondaries are there, and it's also something I need to work on. But... 22.5 mil raw herb XP in just herbs. It's just great. I have 16K toad flax, 13K, 13.7K snaps. It's something that'll last me. I don't want to say the word forever, but these will probably green log me next, which is something that I'm interested in. Um, now that I have pet, maybe not ancient hilt. It'd be cool. It's, it's a cool thing to have. But full Torva, I have the Van Braces already. Full Torva and the Horn would be fantastic, basically. And I'm really looking forward to that. But we're going to go check the seeds. Uh, another little thing I've been doing and working on is... Oh, look. <laughs> yeah, man. Uh, 
Um, yeah, so it's just another little thing I've been working on. Uh, I filled my bucket. So now I don't, hell yeah. Now I don't have to, um, now I don't have to, sorry. We've been doing Fasani's every day together. He's missing Mason Harm. Um, so yeah, uh, let's go check the farming guild real quick. And uh, check the seedy seeds. So we are completely, I keep these to do contracts just in case I have them. I once that time, six, okay, close. But um, I keep these seeds here uh, to do contracts, like I said. So that's something I've been working on. Um, and then obviously I keep working on my, let me go here. I keep doing my, I do my jute runs because I'm going to make drift nets. I tried drift nets uh, the, to make them. Um, and I'm doing seaweed for the pet. It's almost 14K. I don't know how much we'll get. Let's see. Pet or 100K first? I guess we'll see. You can write in the comments your, your choice. And maybe one day we'll look back at this and see what we have. Um, how many seaweed I have at the end. Uh, I'm still doing regular herb runs. I do big tree runs uh, like magics and palms and uh, whenever mahoganies are ready, basically. I just do full runs of that. So that's good. Um, Banks at nine bill. I'm a happy camper. We are we are gaming, I guess you could say. Uh, I'm so happy. I just can't tell you. When I got when I saw the Inquisitor plates here, I swear I almost cried. Like I, I almost just just couldn't handle it anymore with uh, the amount of relief I had and then the ancestor hat I was like, Oh well, that's the icing on the cake for this month. It's been a great month, um, overall for the gains. Um, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, I'm, I don't know what I'm going to do. You know, I think for sure that will be corp for sure. I will put up some corp kills for sure. I'm gonna put up some Fasani kills. Maybe I'll try to get to 400 CMs as well. Um, we'll try to see if we can, I don't know. Maybe I'll go to hard mode tops if I can find good teams. Um, but yeah, so it's, it's going to be super nice. Uh, and yeah, that's really all I got to say. Hope you guys are uh, doing well. Hope everyone in the world is doing well. With all that's happening uh, around us, um, stay calm, stay chill, keep the gains up, and hope you guys have a nice month. I'll see you soon, and um, yeah, have a great day. Peace.